believe I have found 007 and his smoke screen. Hmm. Smoky. That dude's gonna be like 100 pounds short of whatever dust he's hauling. <laughs> he's, he's losing most of it to the wind. <laughs> All right, trucking junkie, so get this. I pull in and over here at Joplin to sit for the night and I'm talking to the wife and I wasn't going to film a whole lot today but I had to walk across the street. I got something I got to show you guys. Look at that. <laughs> How many of you guys remember that? He's got the trailer. It's painted all the way down. Completely black underneath. He's even got the mural on the on the back. I was talking to the wife and I told her, I said, I said, I gotta walk across the street. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. and his smoke screen. Hmm. Smoky. That dude's gonna be like a hundred pounds short of whatever dust he's hauling. <laughs> he's, he's losing most of it to the wind. <laughs> Good morning, trucking junkies. We're in Oklahoma City at Bedford where are we at man Bedford fencing man something like that oh had a very relaxing day yesterday driving got her parked pretty early about 4 30 mm. also got up early this morning like 4 30 <laughs> <laughs> like 4 30 yesterday morning too mm. going off there oh we stayed man so i picked this up I got there just a little after 11. I was there all day and all night. They didn't get me in there until, I don't know, five o'clock, something like that. But y'all saw all that. Oh. Next week's a short week. I'll be home on Wednesday. We have a pre-plan to go to Fort Smith. Well, we have a deadhead to go to Fort Smith after this. Not sure where they're gonna, where the load's gonna go. 
uh, wherever it goes, if it goes to Georgetown, it'll be Georgetown and back. It'll probably be Michigan, if I had to guess. That means I'll leave on Sunday. They could have sent me to go get uh, aluminum over at Sapula, or however you say it. Tony, how do you say it? Sapula, Sapula, whatever. But they didn't do that either, so no big deal. I was talking to my wife this morning and I asked her because I need a I needed a woman's opinion I heard something yesterday that just boggles my mind I don't know if you know who Pete Davidson is you should that's an L member weirdo dude skinny <clears throat> he is dating Kim Kardashian now apparently he has dated Kim Kardashian now, Kate Beckinsale, a couple of models, Ariana Grande. I don't, I don't, I don't see his appeal. So I asked my wife, and she said she had no idea. She said I, she said it, it just may be that, you know, beta male thing he's got going on non-threatening I guess childlike adolescence I don't know maybe these older women are looking for somebody to take care of what do you think put it down in the comments below do you think Pete Davidson warrants dating some of the hottest women in 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 the world <clears throat> I'm gonna say no but that's just me oh I'm gonna get the rest of this stuff off. Get unloaded. Check that out, people. Lamborghini Gallardo. Get out of the way, silver truck. Oh, what's that dude doing? Oh, he's gonna back it up for me. Oh, it's black. I want one, damn it. There he goes. Isaac, buy me that for Christmas. <laughs> 